Alhamdulillah wa salatu wa salam ala Rasulillah wa ba'd. My dear brothers and sisters, Salah is a gift from Allah. Salah is the greatest honor that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave us. Salah is not a burden to be discharged. This is a very sad thing that we, those who don't pray, don't pray. But those who pray, also many of us are those who consider prayer, prayer and Salah to be a burden, to be discharged, to be done away with, to be finished. Salah is something to be approached with great joy, with great shock, uh, with great desire and say, when will the time come for me to connect with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? Think about this. The, uh, we know from the uh, story of uh, Ibn Abbas anhu. Somebody asked his uh, servant, tell me the life of Ibn Abbas. What, how does he spend his day? The man said to him, he waits for, from one salah he waits for the next salah and in between in that time he, he recites Quran. Now he was a businessman, he used to do business and so on and so forth. But this was his, he used to wait for the next salah and he used to recite Quran while he was doing that, while he was doing his business and so on and so forth. So think about this, people who understood the value of salah, they valued the salah, they waited for the salah. When the salah came, they approached it with great joy, with great rejoicing to say that Alhamdulillah, now is the time for me to connect with my Rabb Jalla Jalaluhu, to tell him my story, to ask him for protection, to ask him for help, to ask him for whatever I want, to thank him for all that he has given me, that which I asked for, that which I never asked for. I didn't even have the shaur and the understanding to ask him for those things, but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave me anyway. This is my Rabb. How beautiful is my Rabb? How lovely is my Rabb? How much I want to meet my Rabb? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has witnessed, Wallahi, I want to meet my Rabb. I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala also to want to meet me. I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said in his, in his hadith narrated by Abu Hurairah radiallahu the one who wants to meet Allah, Allah wants to meet him. And I bear Allah, I make Allah my witness to say that I want to meet him and I want him to meet me. This is the purpose of Salah. The purpose of Salah is to meet Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It is the Mi'rajul Muslim. It is the per, it is the time when the person, the normal Muslim, when he is when he is close to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa said, when you make sujood on this earth, remember that you are making sujood before the arsh of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This is Salah. Salah is the greatest blessing of Allah and we thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Jalla Jalalu for giving it to us and we ask Allah to enable us to uh, to discharge this this uh, beautiful honor and this responsibility in a way that pleases him wa sallallahu ala nabiyil kareem wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in bi rahmatika ya arhamar rahimin